Yo, what's the word? It's your boy 16. If you like the content on this channel, I want to ask you to like, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to click that bell for post notifications. Also, I got a website at www.16shotonvisuals.com. But that's enough of me talking. Let's get to what y'all came to see. What's going on with you on look for? And you know, the last interview, I don't remember if I asked you on camera or off camera, but you ain't really want to speak on it or say too much. But like, now I see you on the internet and you got on his ass, so like, what's, you know, what's going on? Yeah, it's just been an ongoing situation, you know, so I don't know why people like fans and shit, they're you know, outside looking in, so they think it's just a new me out the blue tweaking, but it really is not. This shit go years back. But it's like, you know, with me, it's like, shit, I'm a real street nigga. I'm a real nigga, so it's like, you got two, you ain't, you ain't get, you got one time to play with me, and that's just for a regular nigga on the street. If you inside with me, I ain't gonna lie, you get chances by being on the inside with me. Like real talk, and that's how I feel about the shit. So it's just years, years of unspoken, un, untalking to each other, miscommunication, and then it's just like shit. You know me, I'm gonna be out west. Just that's just me. So it's like I'm not gonna really just off jump off the rip first day we get into it, none of this shit, and just go straight to the media. This shit been happening for years that people don't see. You know, yeah. it's just this one. Let like the internet they looking at like I, I seen a lot of little blogs like damn. He snaked his homie, like, y'all don't know, like, this shit go years back, back, and the fact that I still had that good, good, you know, I don't want no, no, no other shit for them years, that's cool. Cause I'm letting the streets be the streets, but when you keep playing, man, keep playing, man, keep playing, man, you ain't gonna be able to, you ain't gonna be able to do shit. You ain't really got to throw in the towel, cause it's me. You talking about out west, you involved in out west, everybody is, I'm gonna tell you this, everybody is successful out west than my people. Name an artist out west right now that's successful. We're, we're on, or on the rise. All us linked in. Like you can't TV fucking talk so. down on me to somebody else and thinking you're gonna still be the new shit from out west. <laughs> you can't. That shit over with. That's like dissing fucking. That's like being from Chicago and saying you don't fuck with Chief Keef. Who the fuck gonna listen to your music? How you think out west look at me? Hey, this, this ain't no kid shit, bro. I know people in real life. like. So ain't no rap shit neither, you know? But if I know, like, that's what we both do. I rap, you rap. So it's like, I don't want to see you hurt. You don't want to see me hurt. But you're not finna be no rapper. And we not, you know, shit like that. You got to be cool with me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my grandma, shit. That's just raw and cut. You got to be, that's how I am. Well, if you want to continue to do what you're going to do, do it. But shit, I'm one of them niggas. You need on your team to be doing what you're going to be doing, you know? I'm not a nigga that's supposed to be on the other side of the fence, you know? Because I'm a real, I'm a real big dude. So it's like, you can't hide me on the ops. I'm going to make them better. Not saying I fuck with the ops. I'm just saying, that's just metaphorically, that's how I'm explaining this shit. Like, I'm a nigga you want on your squad. You don't want to piss me off. Because I ain't on no back that shit. I never carry bad energy. I fuck with you, I fuck with you. The next person can't tell me nothing about you and it's up behind you. So to get into a me is like, you gotta look at yourself sometimes, shit. You can't look at me like I'm tweaking. You gotta see if you tweaking or not. Cause I don't ever tweak on none of my homies. And they, they got their own man, shit. Everybody got their own man and shit. We don't never cross paths. If I'm steady finding myself crossing paths with you, shit, you want some smoke. So you know like, <laughs> Was y'all having like back and forth where like y'all try to fix it and be cool and then fall out? Cause I think it looks like- And I'm gonna I'm, I'm, I'm keep it up all the way a buck. I'm not in tour with him. On the floor I'm not. At the end of the day, it's still like, a motherfucker, I wanna, wanna see nothing happen to him. When I get in tour with people, bro, I don't give a fuck what happened to you. This a nigga I don't wanna see nothing happen to, but it's like, I know he big to the media and shit, but it's like, I don't, that's why I really don't elaborate on the media things. Cause he, he big, I'm big. And it's gonna look like, you know, a messy situation, but it's really not. This shit really simple to me. It's mine as hell. It's real small to me. So it's like, but to the next motherfucker looking at it like, damn, they both came up with each other and all this yeah. foo gang shit. Bro, y'all don't know. Motherfuckers, I had shorty back. So it's like, I don't give a fuck what y'all talking about. But in this day and age, I don't need no motherfucker. I'm, I'm, I'm him. Shit, I'm not him, but I'm him. I'm that dude. <laughs> Fuck you talking about who I need. Now when you sometimes you got sure nigga, you you don't need them. So you still successful without somebody. Like they be killing me with all this so and so made you shit. How? I vented a lot of shit out once. 
Oh, like, for them. On a song, though, y'all both have y'all own. They ain't like, they listen to the song, they be like, oh, yeah, Lil Fo killed it now. It's just his Yeah, they ain't never did that yeah. type of shit because a lot of people knew what they knew in the streets for real. But I don't, I don't talk bad on him. Yeah. It's just, you gotta, when two grown men talking, y'all gotta talk like grown men. Don't let me be talking like no grown man. You trying to talk to me like a fucking shorty, knowing damn well, <laughs> dude, one of them dudes. So that just come to a point where uh, I, right, you don't want to get this nigga your credit and this your homie, but if you seen another nigga, you gonna get him his credit and shit. This, this a nigga, you know, another nigga like in the same boat as your homie, like, you know? Yeah. Sometimes you get, that's good. Like I seen a post when they be like, you know, niggas be all on celebrity pictures and shit. And don't comment on they homie shit. That's basically what it is. But I ain't gonna let nobody disrespect me like that. So you know, come with some. It sound like, like it ain't really. You know how you say you don't shit that happened to him. Nah, you know? I ain't, ain't yeah. no, ain't no smoke. If that's what I'm fucking thinking, ain't yeah. no smoke, bro. Cause y'all would be friends though, like back locked in, and just what yeah, we was. Right that's what we was. We wanted shit that was boyfriends. We was. He couldn't go nowhere without me, and that's just what it was. Everywhere he went, I was with him. I don't give a fuck where I was at, I was with him. And you couldn't say nothing bad about him to me. You know? Yeah. If you said something bad about him, it was up with you. So it's like, when a motherfucker that you, that got your back like that, don't hide your back no more, you gotta look at yourself. You can't look at dude like he tweaking. You gotta look at yourself. Niggas don't wanna face the man in the mirror because you know, whatever. But you gotta look at yourself like that. Cause the people that got my back like that, Shit, if we have a little altercation, it is what it is. It ain't getting further than that. So, you know, I had seen you speaking on live. You had said something about uh, writing his music or something like that. Is that is there any truth to that? Um, it ain't, it ain't false. I want to get myself his, his, I want to say I made him. I ain't make him, he made himself. But I'll say I helped him like, perfect his craft, because at the time, I was perfecting my craft too. So it's like, shit, if you more advanced than me, which I was more advanced than him at the time, shit, it was like, shit, I'm gonna help get where, get where you supposed to be. I want no hating ass nigga, you know? I put my career, it's been plenty of time where I put my career on the back burner to shit, make sure his career was. Nigga, when he started, when he got popping, I was in jail. I was sitting in jail. Nigga, you think I got out mad? No, I was still got out with the same energy. Like, damn, one of them held it down. I got locked up. But it's like, shit, I could have been mad. I wasn't mad. That's, that's where I want to look for was, goddamn it. Yeah. Bigger than salsa. Bigger than any Chicago motherfucker, period. I ain't going to get short get, even throw no dirt on him. Lil Fo was one of the biggest artists to come out of Chicago. Like, everybody know that. You know, yeah, yeah, but I was uh, in jail, nigga. If you my man's, and I, I'm the biggest artist in Chicago, you think you would be in jail? Hell no. Nah. All right then. So motherfucker need to shut the fuck up talking to me. <laughs> I'm t- I ain't talking to you. You know you my boy. I'm talking about period. Every yeah. motherfucker out of town is don't know. Boy, my homie would not be in jail if I'm at my peak. Listen to me. Like on my bond group. type shit. Hell, yeah, my oh, bond yeah. with ten bands. My people them had the money, but you know what I told them? I don't want them to waste their money. They not rappers, they not getting that money like that. You know, they working for this shit. I told my mama, nigga, my mama on the phone crying, I'm in the jail. You better not bond me out. I'm gonna sit to my court dates. I sent that bitch for like five months. That was all right, shit. I ain't no bitch ass nigga. I had the deck when I was locked up. I'm in Joliet, what the fuck? I'm a real foe, this my deck. I'm putting niggas on check for hygiene. All that shit, you musty, boy, get in the shower for, 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 for all foes go to the bathroom. <laughs> oh my grandma, and I was 18, but I was, shouldn't have been in that predicament, you know? Yeah. But by me being who I am for real, I was okay with it. By me being okay with it made other niggas feel like it's okay to leave your homie locked up while you at your peak. It's okay with it, cause he a real gangster. I know he a real gangster, he cool. No, it ain't cool, nigga, go get dude. Yeah. Fuck you, turn out, nigga. So, I can really be pissed off, but I'm just, I'm chilling. I'm for now. I'm, I'm doing good. So, you know, like, if he called your phone, you know, in the future or something, and, and want to sit down and talk and, like, get shit to how it is.